boy. You believe in uh, these dumb mediums? A medium? The psychic mediums. Eric doesn't. Eric doesn't? Or right. Eric does? Uh -oh. no, I know what he was doing. Oh, I, no. I get uh, it. What, 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 what happened? Danny was saying that Eric does not believe in mediums because his shirt size is obviously <laughs> <significant>. <laughs> All right. <laughs> that's a good one. Oops. Closer to a double XL. <laughs> what does the uh, Amazing bad. Randy say? He offers a, I believe it's a million dollar check for anyone that can absolutely withstand his tests and prove real psychic activity. So why wouldn't someone like the Long Island Medium take him up on that? that looks no like, one has been able to do it. A, that's free money, quick million, plus it would be headlines yep. all over the world. Yep. So why do they avoid those challenges? Huge. He th none of them have been able to do it under, under test conditions. None. None so far, right? Zero. Have anyone, has anyone tried? I don't know. I'm sure they have. But he's been debunking a lot of these... Uh, no. Well, the way he phrased it is he is unable to find evidence of real psychic ability. I, uh, rubber guard fan. She was on Rana Fez this year and uh, Red Fez not very successfully. No? We got figures. <clears throat> what was her excuse? Probably because the, uh, the, the radio activity, the radio waves were just, you know, uh, interfering. interfering. <laughs> Ugh. Ugh. And she comes from Long Island. Had a lot of cool people come from Long Island. She's an well, embarrassment. It's also been, you know, Joel Rifkin. Oh, wow. Well. Yeah. <laughs> Colin Ferguson? Well, <laughs> Colin Ferguson, Joel well, Rifkin. Wait a minute. Hey, man, those Another guys reference. Those guys were superstars. <laughs> it never ends. Yeah. <laughs> they were superstars. Superstars. <laughs> <laughs> they made their mark. Sure did. This hack will be gone in a couple of years, doing her dumb readings from her stupid basement again. How do they get shows like that? Just and Katie Couric. Well, I was bummed, man. I, I, I tried to like get into it a little bit on Twitter, but I, I needed more fucking characters. I'm like, come on. that's all You're, you're doing a fluff piece with her. Fucking challenge her. Yeah. Why wouldn't she challenge her as an ex-media person? Exactly. If that's the kind of t stuff you're doing with your talk show, you're going to be another talk show that's in deep fucking trouble. Mm. Like Jeff Probst. Her, oh, God, that Jeff Probst. Show. What's her name, this woman? Uh, woman? Teresa uh, uh, Caputo. Caputo, something like that. What the hell is this guy? Hmm? <laughs> uh, is he trying psychic stuff on... What theory, the as yet unproven, of course, is that it's accomplished simply by blowing, though, rather cleverly, I must admit... Oh, fucking uh, the amazing Randy yeah, just the blows best. up this guy's spot. Mm -hmm. What is this? It's a long one? video. Can, oh, yeah? Who's that? Is that <clears throat> Bob Barker? Uh, In the middle? Kind of looked like it. Stop him from turning yeah. the page. Yeah, so here the you see right. Right. James Hydrick perform his miracle, and ten minutes later fail at the same miracle when cheating is taken out of the equation. Can we uh, see? Can we see oh, the original? Look at this <laughs> oh, he's, Let's he's see the original. Bonin. What's the original? Let's see the original uh, miracle. Can we see? What, it's a long video. I just want to see what yeah, the moment, yeah. of, the first moment of it is. Yeah, it's where he put. There's a bunch of paper. Well, not yet. Not the paper oh. yet. Now he's doing something with a pencil on the edge of a table. I guess his claim is he can move things with his mind, right? Yeah, but why? So that pencil is pretty much 50% over the edge of the table. Right. And now... So all you would need is a slight vibration. That thing would fucking fall. Well, he's doing some kind of kung fu-y looking moves. Yeah, he's but... obviously can blow very, very subtly. If... Oh, you think that's what's going on? Yeah, I think he blows the... So air. why does he have to have the pen halfway off the table to make this work? Well, it's very difficult to move things with your mind, so it's got to be right on the brink of moving. <laughs> and, and you just put it over the edge, oh, you know? Thank you for explaining yeah, that. Yeah, sure. I'm not like smart his, enough to understand that. Imagine fucking his, Mo Hair, Howard haircut. Imagine if his nose was stuffy. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. The pencil just pivoted. Pivoted because it's on the edge of a table. Yes. And there's stupid Bob Barker flapping like a seal. Does this guy not know James Randi is backstage? No. Is it what true a that fucking you can blind also side. Turn the, pages turn the pages of this telephone directory. Yes, directory. Right? And you will do that for us? I'll try. Should I take I'll the pencil try. off the table? Yes. All right. Oh, this guy's hateable too. Hey, James, All right, would you so like to open it to any page or should you I'll, want me to do it? I'll be happy. He puts the phone book on the table. Mm. Right. <clears throat> How does he blow so quietly, and though? I don't know. That's his whole gimmick, right? It's probably through his nose. You think? Sure. Now he's going to move the pages, I gather. 
We're waiting. This is, Sorry um, about this. By the way, a phone book, kids, is what we used to use to find phone yeah. numbers. <laughs> It's a big, giant book. Way before your smartphone. In alphabetical order. Yeah, he's doing all these hand movements by yeah, the he's phone book. over-dramatizing yeah. everything. Oh, oh he's, he's not feeling it. No, oh, he's, boy. He's dramatically right. walking yeah, away. away. Yeah, he walks away. He's like, got to gather himself, guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ready? All right. Now he... Oh, Jesus. Whoa. And then he walks by. He walks right back, and his hand is over it. And the two pages turn. And it turns. Yes. And you turn the page now I'm gonna now, fuck you these over. Demonstrations, Wait. you did these same demonstrations on That's Incredible. Yes, I did. And as you know, the amazing He's... Randy maintains that you did not use psychic power, oh, but that it was trickery. Mm. And he is uh, prepared uh. to pay you $10,000. Back wow. then, yeah. If you can do it using psychic power. Later in our show, you two will meet head to head and we will test your psychic powers to the nth degree. And I know oh, that he looks you worried. at oh. home are not going to want to miss that. No, we're not, Bob Barker. We're right. not. His, his face. He's bummed. You literally couldn't have been sadder if he said, we have a nostril cam. <laughs> Holy shit. Once again, here is the man who claims to have psychic powers. Psychic James powers. Heydrich. It's awful. It's a black karate gi. He's just horrible. What a tool. I, I worked security. Stage, you did most impressive. <laughs> That's the blow this guy is. Show. It's because he blows on the saw things. It, I'm sure you were impressed. If you did not, let me explain that. Fast forward to the same. They're just showing the same recap. So the recap. How about you go full screen for us? All right. Here's the amazing. Randy meeting on James love. demonstration from backstage. Yes, I did. And do you yes, accept that as a demonstration of psychic power, or do you believe that he used trickery? I don't accept it as a demonstration of psychic power, Bob. Yeah. I think that the solution is rather simple. I think that Mr. Heydrich is merely to accomplish this effect, blowing on both the page and on the pencil. And the guy's standing there like, oh, fuck, he's now, got me. You huh. originally to me. asked him to demonstrate in two different ways his psychic power. Yes. But as I understand it, you are now prepared to waive the demonstration with the pencil. Yes, and the reason is rather simple because the pencil reacts to even the currents of the air conditioning in this studio. It will be very difficult Ready. to Puts try the, to put uh, controls on it in such down, a way that off the edge. normal currents of air that are present all the time would not move the pencil. For example, oh. it moves very, very easily. Oh. Right, you're not going to ask he just reenacted it. Yes. They reenacted the pencil James. thing in two seconds. You are prepared to pay him $10,000 if he can turn the page of the telephone directory with certain controls. Oh, That's right. Boy. You have the $10,000, do you, Randy? I do indeed. Oh, he carries it's, it uh, out right with here. him? Yeah. <laughs> I've carried this check now for going on check. 17 years, Bob. Uh, there it is, a check for $10,000 oh, so awarded to dollars. the gentleman, no, should he be oh, able to successfully keeps... perform the demonstration. This is probably 1980. I would like to oh, introduce... Oh, this guy's <laughs> bummed. <laughs> oh, Our first shit. judge here, His face Dr. Is John bummed. Palmer, is a psychologist oh. and professor of parapsychology at... John F. Right, Kennedy. What is this show called? Right Fuck there, you. Dr. Palmer. <laughs> Dude, we have his Dr. fucking Stephen face. Drake, astronomer and Without a lot of instrumentation to demonstrate that fact by using one very simple control. Oh, now, uh, let me just emphasize oh, the guys this one over control, like, What's the control will not stop him from turning the page of the telephone directly. That's right. But you hope to the judge's satisfaction will demonstrate that he is doing it with his breath. Oh, That's boy. Correct. All right. Oh, oh, look at this guy. Guy. oh he's shit, he's bumming. What I have here is particles of a white plastic, oh, which no. when given a good puff, good heavy puff of air, will, I think, rather conclusively show oh, no. whether or not <laughs> blowing is a method of accomplishment. He's surrounded the phone book now with like styrofoam uh, strips that strips will genuine psychic will move very easily with, with air. But it so certainly should blowing, be very interesting indeed to see will move. what now occurs. Or do you maintain oh, that no. if the page of the telephone direct returns that we will see movement in the styrofoam as well? I think that it's pretty logical. We've experimented with it, Bob, and that's what oh, we no. have determined in <laughs> the experiments. Oh, man, he Very well. Are you ready him. to proceed? I am indeed. Judges, you're ready? Oh, James? look at this. Ready. <laughs> ready. 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 <laughs> this is why you never heard from the guy again. Oh, now he's doing this mumbo jumbo with his hands. Oh, he's he's thinking like, can I really do this? <laughs> maybe, maybe I can. <laughs> and he's not even getting down low by the phone book, is he? 
No, nothing's moving. Nothing's moving. Oh, no. Nothing's moving. No, it's not moving oh, at all. He's, no, nothing's he's doing moving. his magical moves, but nothing's moving. Do you know how bad he wants to go? Can we do this? Let me get rid of this styrofoam. It's yeah. killing my vibe. Nothing's moving. How fucking embarrassing. <laughs> oh, now he's getting down to the level of the uh, oh, how phone book. Embarrassing. He's right? smiling. Figure kind of. it out right Wait now. Wait a minute. Yeah, he's like, uh, There's another way I can do this. Yes, can I do this? Can I blow on this just enough How without moving the... Ah, he's, his face just grimaced. He just went like, mm. uh. Look, it's a tough math problem. Yeah, yeah. Oh. This guy is <laughs> fucked right steady. here. His whole career of he's being a magical look guy. Look at him squatting. He's holding himself up with one hand. Oh, is he fucking panicking? He's getting into some dramatic positions, but it's yeah. not going to help him. He's looking, trying to figure out how just can I do this and not it. move that fucking styrofoam. Yeah, he hates styrofoam to this day. <laughs> Everything he ships breaks because he refuses to touch styrofoam. Oh, he, he shook, shook his, his head. head. Now he walked He's away. This time, how many, how many pages? More. Just one page. Once. All right, this now. Time once more. Now he's pacing. Oh, he's asking James. Questions. You had another question. Mm -hmm. oh. Take a home. What, is, what would you ah. like okay. to ask? The styrofoam and the lights form electricity, which pulls the page. Look. <laughs> what? He's lifting He's it up. It's, it's pulling the page down. Oh, how great is he? <clears throat> and then it turns the way it's supposed to. Page yeah. Down. No, it's pulling it the right way. <laughs> he's he's holding the page up, and it's turning the proper right, way. He's trying so to demonstrate how the page like isn't moving, but it's to moving. To ask Randy to allow you to do or for me to, to do. either take something else, either lighter or something that is going to keep, that isn't going to form like a static electricity. You mean put something <laughs> else, some other material around something here? Something that is not foam. <laughs> foam causes static electricity, and the light <laughs> is what heats it up. Oh, right, Randy, is there oh, anything no. else that you can put around the telephone directly? I've heard the question, but the question is not valid because it's making an assumption which is not true. The foam does not in any way create static electricity, and... Mr. Heydrich, in demonstrating that the pages were clinging together, didn't demonstrate it to my satisfaction. <laughs> I think exactly. they would perhaps ask the judges for their opinion on that. I am not a scientist, so I'm not qualified to declare on it. Judges? Whatever static electricity exists in the styrofoam would not really affect the movement of the page no, or exactly. the clinging of the pages together, in my opinion. I, yeah. would, I would add that if this is, in fact, psychic functioning, I don't really see why that would make a difference. Uh oh, very well. Randy, would you allow me to turn perhaps half a dozen pages and then put them back? Uh, oh yes, you may. <laughs> oh, this is so, such a great up. fucking. Oh, okay. <laughs> this guy's getting fucked. Two. And I'm getting a really good update on this guy uh, after this is over. Oh really? Really right. good. Yeah, like that? That's fine. Gently place him down gently so it doesn't disturb the phone. All right. I know, uh, well, oh, I thought you. Oh, the other way? Him. Yeah, the other way. That's what I thought you meant. Would that sure be helpful? Oh, sure. Sure. I'm not the gonna be able to do it anyway. Still be here because of the phone. Uh, well, it is the opinion of the judges that there is not enough static foam well, by my the, opinion. the foam to be a problem. So, uh, under the conditions agreed upon, it uh, oh. would seem that now you should at least try oh, with psychic oh, power oh, to turn the page oh, of the top. Bob wants to just see all that yeah. shit blow off the Boy, table. Yeah, they yeah. knew how to fuck people in the late... Yeah. Boy, they, did they ever. All right, he's back in his weird... Kung Fu fucking position. Oh, he's now been, he's laughing. He's, he's so fucked. This is affecting his livelihood. Yeah. <laughs> that dumb hairdo. Oh, his horrid hairdo and his fucking, mm -hmm. his trickery. Why mm -hmm. would you accept this challenge? Why? Why? What's that? What a great show. A great I, show. Oh, this show is just fuck this guy. <laughs> and you know that, Fuck our guest. <laughs> this week on Fuck This Guy. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, fuck this guy. Oh, he's doing the hand motion, but they're not even convincing. No. It's, he's just kind of hanging his hands over the book. Now he's what do you do in this position? Do you just say fucking and blow it? Off. You do what he did. You, he came up with a good excuse, the static electricity. I was yeah, like, he's he, a pretty good thinker. That's the whole time he was doing the fucking mumbo jumbo. He's thinking, what can yeah. I say? Yeah, I say static. <laughs> he's going to stick with that static electricity yeah, thing. It's just, it's, and the light heats it. Yeah, the light moving heats his hands it in that like, fucking magic way. Uh-oh, uh -oh, he's like, back no. up. He's standing up again. He shook his head. Is no. this going to uh, turn for you? No, it isn't. Oh. Well, have you reached the point then when uh, at, at which we can declare to admit that the demonstration flawed. terminated? This isn't a magician's trick. I can't just come up, bang, bang, and it's over. Oh. I have to be to where I can work with something small and then big, you know, to build up my own self. But you did it. Oh, so this is the mustache. Uh, it has to be done 
you know, this is just, it's power. It's, it's mental power. Oh. The conditions agreed upon have been Number fulfilled. Mm -hmm. And, of course, we can't change the conditions now in midstream. Oh. So, in oh, yeah. the opinion yeah. of our judges here... This guy's full of you shit. You have not seen a demonstration of psychic power, have you? Yes, that's correct. You have not. And, Randy... Uh, huh. What about that check, Randy? James has not won the $10,000 with this demonstration. So it seems. Now, you have heard what James's explanation is. Do you have any comment to make on that? Bob, the, the comment very uh, briefly is that I have gone through many hundreds of these tests with many hundreds of people who claim to have psychic powers. And uh, quite frankly, it's more or less the same story every time. When a simple, direct, very uncomplicated protocol is used and the control is applied, the psychic forces don't seem to be present, uh -huh. if indeed they are ever present at all. I still look for some sort of evidence of psychic powers. To date, I have not found any. Up to this very moment, I am still totally unconvinced. Exactly. Judges, do you have any further comment to make? You agree that you have not seen a psychic demonstration? Oh. Uh, yes, I, I would agree that I have not seen a psychic demonstration. Uh, I would like to say that as a parapsychologist, I believe that there are uh, other evidence under, under control conditions that do... Uh, Demonst demonstrate, I would think, to a reasonable person that psychic phenomena do exist, yes. but uh, obviously not in this in this uh, demonstration. <laughs> I want to thank you very much. Well, he shakes his thank hand. Thank you so much. Why would you shake Bob Barker's hand? Yeah. yeah. He just fucked oh, up your life. It was, it was, it was a different time. Before I say goodbye to you, Randy, I do indeed oh, wow. appreciate the fact that you joined us on That's My Line, Dr. Palmer. Okay. That's Hi. my Mike. line. Dr. Wow. Mike. Thank you so much. Look at him in the back. Oh, uh, he's back there. He's fucked. So, we'll be back. so that's uh, James uh, Heydrich, I guess. Yeah, from that's incredible. Mm. So there's a bunch of people that know about James Heydrich. He oh. was never really heard from again. Really. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that's good. totally and fucked them right there. Them. And Kevin from Connecticut and others uh, have written me. And in 1989, this guy James Heydrich received a 17-year sentence. What? For molesting five boys. Wait, that's him? He's currently incarcerated at a California prison. 89? Why is he 99 OC shipping out in 06? Mm. That's him? Yeah, mm -hmm. he was released and then got charged for sexual assault and went back in. <laughs> Wait, what a piece of shit. Wait, he got charged again? Yeah. So he was doing a se he did his 17 year sentence, whatever that ended up being, and then he got out and then he molested again? Oh. Allegedly? Yeah, it oh, says right You can here. see it in his eyes. It's the same guy. Terrible Just guy. older now. In 89, he got the 17-year sentence, and uh, he did it. And he is currently incarcerated at California Men's Colony, whatever, oh, prison uh, for sexual assault, is what Wikipedia says. He says. got mad because his victims just started putting styrofoam around their assholes. <laughs> 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 he couldn't do it. <laughs> what a fucking creep. Uh, he's a ghoul. What a creep. Oh. What, what? Is there more? <laughs> well, just from what we just watched, after an hour and a half of him staring at the pages, the show is edited for time. So wow. That, that went on for an hour, an hour and a half. Hour yeah. and a half. Wow. No kidding. Jesus Christ. He was just evaluating everything. <laughs> yeah. Is the yeah. amazing Randy still alive? Oh, yeah. Because he looked kidding? really old in that. He looked old right yeah, there. No, he, and check, that's got to be uh, almost 30 years ago, that clip, right? Look, look him up, Sam. I believe he is alive. <laughs> he, uh... If you want to have a, some fun, look up Amazing Randy Clips online. He's great. He is great. He debunks everyone. He also... Made a, made a life of it. He confessed his fraud in 1981 and admitted that he developed his unique talent while he was in prison, that he did not learn it from a Chinese master. Wow. Ah! ah. Mm. That's Hydra. His unique talent. Exposed. He was in jail before that, too. Yeah. Isn't there something with Houdini, too? He's dead. No, but supposedly Houdini gave some kind of password. And, uh, and you know, and then his wife would talk to these people. Oh, yeah. And uh, all all she wanted was, well, what was the password that he, he you know, he gave me? Hmm. And not one person was able to do it. Bosco. Cause oh, he, he was busting them. Bosco. <laughs> Bosco. Huh? Yeah, look up the Houdini thing, because that's another one where, where you know, Houdini promised he would come back and talk from uh, the afterlife, and he told his wife, look, you know, here's the password in case oh. someone, 
in case someone you know is telling you that they're uh, they, how smart they're getting uh, you know a message or whatever from me from the afterlife, mm -hmm. and not one psychic was able to uh, come up with the password. Yes, the password is Houdini. That's right, <laughs> <laughs> Houdini. Yes, <laughs> magic. Damn. That's all crap. Yeah, I think so too. We don't know everything yet, but this shit is crap. <laughs> Katie Kirk just drove me nuts with by not challenging her and allowing her to do her nonsense. Mm. What a load of shite. Mm -hmm. yeah. That guy got so fucked. <laughs> How great was that with his oh. dumb mustache? Oh, he was trying to look the part. His <clears throat> pedo stash. He was Those just... shows back then, like, like who would agree to go on that? They pre I bet you that they worded it. In such a way where you thought you could work, you could do it. Yeah. It's yeah. ten thousand bucks in nineteen eighty. That's like a hundred thousand dollars. Because if you're the guy that's blowing onto the onto little boys and uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, phone books, it I don't know. Was. Uh, you're thinking in your mind, all right, how can they fool me? Mm -hmm. And he probably went through all the scenarios. Went, oh, I can work around all that. Ninety minutes. <laughs> Ninety minutes of watching that asshole in a karate. Imagine that doing his fucking dumb hand kid moves. fucker. That oh, kid fucker oh, doing his little hand moves. Been. It brings huh? us back the to yeah. it, it brings us back to today. Isn't David Blaine's uh, trick almost over? It ended last night. And didn't he have uh, like an incident, like we all said would happen? He had low blood sugar or oh, something. No. It kind of had a little. He was swaying did or they, something. Did they have to lead him off like they always do from oh, his no. tricks? <laughs> he was snoozing. He was snoozing. I went down and was saw he him losing? Yesterday. He was sleeping. Because I heard. He was sleeping standing up? Yeah, I caught him. He kept falling asleep while he was up there. Was he being electric electrified at that point? There were some bolts here and there. <laughs> some bolts here and there. Oh, Another boy. asshole. Yeah. It didn't look like that. Another asshole that people just fucking want to buy into. David Blaine was getting electrocuted, was he? Really? Yeah. yeah. Sure he was. Okay, sure. Yeah. Sure uh -huh. he was. Yeah. <laughs> I think we got D.L. Hughley coming in now. Oh.